What is up guys and welcome to the South Coast. Today's video, we're doing a little tire plug-in on the Bad Boy Maverick. Last time I went and cut, I appear to have run across a nail or something. So, we're gonna get this tire plugged. guys so we got some air put back in this tire I think I found where the leak is looks like there's a little bit of a maybe a, some sort of thorn or branch or something got stuck in there so we're gonna see if we can get that out go ahead and get it plugged all right guys well this is the tire plug kit that I use I got it on Amazon I can put a link down in the description it's a pretty good kit. Um, some of the stuff in here is pretty cheap. Like these pliers are pretty chintzy. This pressure gauge is pretty much junk. Um, I don't know if these valve stems are any good. I haven't had to use one of those. But what is nice is these handles. They're basically a, I don't know if it's solid metal, but it's, it's they're hefty. They feel like they're quality handles. They have replaceable um, bits on them, I guess. And you can see here, there's spare bits in there. Um, so we'll go ahead and ream it out and then get a plug, put in the plug tool, get this hole fixed. All right, guys. Well, it is as easy as that. Let's check it. Looks like no leakage there. Hopefully, that's the only leak we have. So now, we will go ahead and check our tire pressure, get everything set, and we'll be good to go. About 16 there. Go ahead and bring it up to 20. Right on the money. Alright guys, and it is easy as that to plug a little hole there in the tire. Got all my tires inflated to the proper um, inflation pressure. That's it, pressure. Got them all inflated to the proper pressure per what is written on the tires. I know a lot of guys will run, run their tire pressure a little bit lower on these mowers to try to soften the ride up, try to get a little bit better traction, especially on those rear tires. Um, so that may be something I experiment with in the future, but anyway, I'll go ahead and link the um, plug kit down in the description. It's easy as that. You don't have to bring your tire to a tire shop or your mower to a tire shop to get 
little holes like that plugged, it's something that's going to happen uh, throughout the life of your mower. So just be ready for it. Have a plug kit, have a good air compressor, way to pump your tires up, and you'll be good to go. So anyway, quick video, but just wanted to show that to you quick and easy. Get after it. Y'all have a good one. We'll catch you next time down here on the South Coast. Thank mm -hmm. you.